This particular program demonstrates the requirement for casting. In this program, I have declared two integer variables, a initialized with 5, b initialized with 2, and there is another one, a floating point variable r. We actually perform a division operation, a is divided by b, and the result is assigned to r. Then we are printing the content of r. Since the value of a is 5 and b is 2, we can guess that the result of this division operation, a divided by b, is going to be 2.5. But the case is not so. I'm executing the program to show you the result that what it actually prints. Oops, it's not 2.5, rather it's 2.000000. Now why so? It should have been 2.5 because we all know that 5 divided by 2 returns 2.5 and we have R declared as floating point so it should contain 2.5 but the fact is that in programming the conception is same for all the other programs as well now in programming when we are performing operations between two integers the result is always in integers actually in this particular statement a divided by b is performed first a is an integer, b is also an integer, so the result is going to be in integer. So 5 divided by 2, that is actually integer division, so the result is not 2.5, it's actually 2, and that is assigned to r. That's why here we are getting 2.000000 in floating point format. So the fact is that if we have operations between two variables, one is of type int another is of type float then the result is always going to be in float that means if we are having operations in between two variables then the result is going to be always in the format of the variable which is which is of higher precedence if you are having operations operations between two floats then the result is in float but if you are having operations between a float and a double the result is always going to be in double so i can just write the data types in this way to show you the precedence the care come first then the integer then long then float then double then long double the precedence increases in this way actually that means it decreases above and increases downwards so the integer variable is having higher precedence than the character variable long is having higher precedence than the integer variable so an arithmetical operation between a long and int always results in long in order to correct the answer if we want to get the correct answer for this particular operation then always we need to keep in mind that we need to convert one of these variables either a or b to floating point in order to get the exact result if we could convert one of them to floating point then the result is going to be in floats because the operation between an integer and float is always going to be in float so how could we do that how could we just convert the data type uh, how could we just convert the type of one variable to float without actually changing the data type so that can be done that can be done using the casting we do the casting in this way so this is actually known as data type casting now the content of variable a is going to be converted to floating point before performing the division operation so now the result is going to be in floats because now a is represented in float and b is in integer so the result is going to be in floating point now you could have converted b in floats as well let me just execute now here you can see that the result is accurate it's 2.5 so we could have actually converted b as well to float po floating point that would have the same result so let me just execute now here you can see that it's 